studies reveal the thoughts of young men who knew they were going to die. They are part of the story of the Japanese kamikaze pilots of World War II. And for the first time, those personal letters are here in, in Hawaii. KITV4's Paul Drews has more from the battleship Missouri Memorial. The Mighty Mo's big guns are now silent, but during World War II, the powerful guns made battleships like the USS Missouri a tempting target, especially for kamikaze pilots during the Battle of Okinawa. And over 5,000 sailors died during that battle as a result of kamikaze attacks. So it was uh, a clear danger to all the ships, but particularly the battleships, which provided a very important covering fire for all the landing forces and uh, for all the forces that were, that were fighting on the island. Seventy years ago, one Japanese pilot managed to avoid the anti-aircraft fire and barreled into the starboard side of the ship. The pilot of the Zero died instantly. We're 99% uh, certain that it's the uh, pilot whose picture is, uh, is down below and who is on the wayside signage uh, that's over here right where the attack actually occurred. It is believed the pilot was 19-year-old Setsuo Ishino. He's just one of a number of kamikaze pilots in a new exhibit at the Mighty Mo that features more than just personal items and pictures. And it contains letters, uh, the last letters from a number of kamikaze uh, before they went off to do their duty. Those letters came from the Chiron Peace Museum and were brought here by the city's mayor to mark the anniversary of the attack on the Missouri and honor what happened next on her deck. The damage from the kamikaze attack was minimal, but the actions afterwards left a lasting impression that still reverberates today. The next day, the crew of the Missouri gave the pilot an honorable burial at sea uh, with full military honors to uh, recognize him for uh, the duty, honor, and courage that he had exhibited. Even as lookouts scanned the skies for more attackers, the captain of, and crew of the Missouri held a military funeral for the dead pilot with honor and respect. It was a moment of humanity during a violent and deadly war and is now part of the memorial's expanded exhibit on the Japanese kamikaze pilots of World War II. On board the Mighty Mo, Paul Drews, KITV4 News. The exhibit will be up permanently at the USS Missouri Memorial. The letters from the pilots are on temporary loan from the Chiran Peace Museum.